Wire is a 2002 TV series about the mean streets of Baltimore. Cops and robbers stories that provide a window into the American city, institutional power, and the moral codes and compromises of police, drug dealers, politicians, everybody. The show's writers spent years following along Baltimore cops to make sure everything is 100% authentic. It's widely regarded as one of the greatest TV series of all time, so what more can I say? Today's math prop appears in Season 2, Episode 2. Cops find a shipping container full of dead bodies. The medical examiner says they were trapped in there and suffocated. And back at the office, they're joined by this guy who gets out this thing, a slide rule. This show is set in the early 2000s, so the obvious choice for a calculator in this scene would be a calculator, like an electronic calculator. Anything you can do on a slide rule can be done easier and more accurately on an electronic calculator. So why is this guy using a slide rule? I don't know. These people all died because they ran out of air in the shipping container, and the police are trying to figure out how long that would have taken. You take the volume of the container as 13 by 7 by 7, with 13 people breathing 0.25 liters of oxygen per minute, how many minutes would they last? Solving the problem is a matter of multiplying and dividing some stuff, and you can do that on a slide rule. I go 7 times 7 is 49, then divide by 28.3 to convert to liters, then divide by 4 to get the minutes. Looks like 4.3 minutes. I had to do a few big slides there. Now look at how he does it. Either this actor knows some sweet slide rule tricks or he's just faking it. This is a real mystery to me. The greatest TV show of all time made a deliberate choice to give this guy a slide rule and show him using it on camera. Everyone watching the show is going to see it and wonder why. To be honest, I'm still not sure, but here's my theory. Forensic medical technicians actually do calculations all the time, measuring distances from bullet penetration depths, time of death from body temperature, that kind of stuff. And to avoid memorizing formulas and doing calculations by hand, they often use custom-built nomographs and sliding chart calculators. You line it all up and it tells you the answer. I uploaded a silly video of a guy explaining how to use a custom calculator for estimating the time of death. So I think maybe somebody told the writers, oh, you know, those medical guys, they don't use normal calculators. They use these weird sliding charts. And then either the writers or the props guys misunderstood and thought they meant that they use actual slide rules. But why would they? Because they don't, that's why. At least I don't think they do. In summary, I give The Wire Season 2, Episode 2, my math props rating of bad. Thanks to David Lees for the tip and let me know if you see any more.